Oh no. I thought y'all was still back there. This was the car that was behind us. Damn. What is that? It's a bullet hole. No, it's not. It's a plant. Oh! I slammed the fucking brakes in. Dude, no way. How's it going? Hey, good. How are you? Am I going to be on YouTube now? Man, it has been a freaking day. We just left the racetrack. We are on our way back. We just have probably like 10 hours or so. Are you kidding me? A car just pulled out in front of us. Oh my God. You all right? Yeah, y'all got the law. Huh? Y'all call it loud. No, not yet. I just left a little party shit. I, I ain't gonna lie, I thought y'all was still back there down the road or whatever. Oh, I mean, but... I got insurance, the papers in the car if y'all want to. Shit, we can call it loud if y'all want to. Yeah, I'm gonna have to just because I, yeah, I gotta. See, we could get it right then. Hey, we just had a wreck on the. We are almost to the on ramp. Yeah, everybody seems to be okay so far. Y'all are all good, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're good though? Yeah, hell yeah. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, it seems like everybody's okay. All right, now I've got him headed there. Thank you so much. All this gonna be uploaded? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. This will be all in one video. <laughs> hell yeah. Ain't that shit crazy? We should go look at his damage. We need that. We've only been gone from the racetrack for like 20 minutes. That clip that we just filmed at the fucking gas station was literally 10 minutes away. This is the interstate. We have not even made it to the interstate. I suppose. Oh, I'm gonna have to wear your jacket, dude. I'm literally shaking because I have so much like adrenaline and shit going through me, but I'm also just kind of chilly. Yeah, no, it's like 60 something out right now. It looked like there was a car in front of us that got in front of us and a car behind us that got fucking behind us. This is not adding up to me. Why would somebody do that? Like you guys comment down below and tell me, I don't know two separate vehicles. Why would they come to a truck and trailer like this? One passes around the truck and trailer and then pulls over and stops sideways and tries to block both lanes. I slammed and locked up the brakes, dude, and could not avoid from hitting them. Damn. Yeah, we're walking down to go see the car's damage. This was the car that was behind us. This was the car that was in front. Damn. At least not too injured. What is that? That's a bullet hole. No, it's not. 100% is. That is exactly what that was. There was also a block. Oh yeah. Yep. He comes right here. Comes right here. Turns real fast. Drifts and parks in the center of these two lanes. And we're going 50 miles an hour with 20,000 pounds behind us. So I slam the brakes. But by the time we hit them, we're still going like probably 30 miles an hour or something like that. Gotcha, so, gotcha. All right, well, I appreciate it. Just uh, stand by. We had a great fucking night at the track. No kidding. Amazing night at the track. And then we leave the track and it's like, oh, you know that truck you just fixed? Yeah. Fuck. Oh, no. <gasps> that wasn't doing that a second ago. Let me see. No way. You shouldn't breathe that. It's refrigerant oh, from the fucking shit. AC. We're not going to have AC now. Dude, just look at that bitch just fucking smoking. There's no way. That is just insane. Every airbag in that car is deployed. The trunk can't close. The bumper is off. That entire quarter is caved in. That rear axle is completely shifted. I can, uh, I can definitely say girth is 2-0. and oh. Don't pull out in front of 20 5,000 pounds. Drop a like on this video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. For we real. We have to fix this truck again. I know. We had a video literally just two years ago that we just fixed the truck from. Blow up and went viral. 1.1 million views. Don't pull out in front of 25,000 pounds. And here we are again. Girth, man. He saved, he saved us. He, yeah, multiple times like, now. Multiple times. With a trailer behind too. Yeah. Like, it don't give a shit. Woo! Look at it spewing refrigerant it's, out up here yeah. still. Look at all the smoke. Oh my God. No, girl. <sighs> <laughs> I am just like,
I am absolutely amazed at the amount of curveballs that life has thrown me lately. And you know what? I don't even give a shit. Am I gonna stop? Absolutely not. Did I just fix this truck? Yup. But I'll tell you one thing that is also for certain is that there is no shot in the world that this stuff is gonna bring me down. So me and Jess, we're about to go over here, grab some Waffle House. It is actually 4.49 a.m. You ready to grab dinner, baby? I'm so sorry that we were... <laughs> I know we were... I'm... So we pulled over to sleep at a gas station. We wake up to sirens yeah. and... Oh shit, it's a, it's a plant. Oh! As you guys can... As you guys can... Oh my god. Autofocus is so fast. As you guys can... As you guys can probably... Oh my god. As you guys can probably see over there. <laughs> this building is on fire. Every single person is out here right now except for the news. It don't look like it's doing much. I've never seen anything like that. Wow. Last 24 hours has just not even felt like it is a real life experience. It feels like I've been living in a dream and I can't tell if it's a bad one or a good one, but it's been, it's been a time. It has been a time for sure. All right, you can pull forward, thank you. Thank you. We're about to go inside and find out how much this rig weighs. You said what, 20 mm -hmm. out at the truck, so. 24,100. <sighs> I said. And we're on an I empty said. Tank. This is what happens when you pull out in front of 25,000 pounds, part three. I am definitely going to have to save to get this thing fixed again. Saving nowadays is very hard with today's economy, man. Everything is inflated, costs are through the roof. But luckily for today's video sponsor, Upside, they help offset those inflated costs using cash back. This app is especially good for you guys who buy groceries, gas, or dine out. Upside is so easy to use. You just download the app. Next, claim an offer for whatever you're buying. I personally use it every time that we pump gas. And come back here, pump your gas just like normal. Follow the steps in the app and get paid. It is literally that simple. <clears throat> In comparison to credit card loyalty programs, Upside can earn users three times the cash back. And the best part about it is that at any time, you can cash out your rewards to your bank account, PayPal, or even gift cards. And I am definitely gonna need that for this bumper. As you guys can see from the tent on this truck, I love privacy. And that's one of the best things about Upside is they don't sell your information to third parties. So whenever you trust them with your info, you know it's in safe hands. Upside users are earning hundreds of dollars per year. And that's probably why they have a 4.8 star rating on the App Store. So guys, if you are anything like me and use some extra cash coming up go download the upside app use code it's just a six and don't forget you're gonna get 25 cents back for every single gallon off of your first tank of gas with that being said i'm gonna go unpack some bags and then we're gonna show everybody the truck we just, we just, we just did all of that. check it out the grill the bumper the fenders the headlights literally the everything. literal the every specific too. thing oh my goodness gracious yep yeah he thought you could stop so if you missed this guys, me and Poe here rebuilt this truck from this exact same thing happening two years ago and we just got it fixed two weeks ago and now today it is all ruined again. It's been two weeks. Dude. It was insanity what to happened? see. What happened? Like when you hit it, did it just like stick to the bumper Bro. and spin out into so the distance? So dude, dude tries to park and hit the fucking uh in the road. I slammed the fucking brakes and locked them up. Dude, no way. How's it going? Hey, good, how are you? Am I gonna be on YouTube now? So, I turned the camera off because they were actually genuinely awesome, but that was the most like interesting situation I've ever had happen. I just saw a cop car roll up and I was like, that was pretty awesome, dude. They said that they uh, they saw the video of the supercharging the green Roush and saw us helping me and Poe whenever we went and helped clean up all the trees and everything. And they just wanted to stop by and say that was pretty cool of us. Anyway, dude comes up. It's the perpendicular. Uh -oh. Wow. Guys, don't forget you can go to itsjustasix.com right now, grab a shirt just like this, and grab yourself inches in to win this car right here. All proceeds are gonna go towards getting our truck fixed again. Drop a like on this video, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. For we real. have to fix this truck again. I know. 